sure that people that are getting in governance are the people that are not going to be doing corruption within the spheres of government. Because the society people out there, we have seen, we have heard that when we are doing the door-to-door -door campaigns, people are sick and tired of people with corruption. So we trust and, uh, and, and the trust that Comrade Cyril Ramaphosa, under the leadership of Comrade Cyril Ramaphosa, is going to make sure that he deals away with those individuals that are corrupt within the government. Manta! We are gathered here today. We are giving assistance and also coming to support a fundraising initiative okay. for the youth league, especially. Oh, so yes. you're supporting the youth? We are supporting the youth uh -huh. in conjunction with our senior leadership. Wow. So us as parents, we come in full support of the youth. The car wash program is there. Okay. So we are all in the effort of raising funds so they can also establish okay. the funding. Okay. It's important that we show our unity as the ANC, specifically with the kind of problems that we were facing. Mm -hmm. My most important thing that I was focusing on for the past week when we were campaigning is the inclusiveness of persons with disability, both unseen and seen disability. It is, it is a, a social thing that we sit with and we, we are not looking at persons with disability and evaluating our situations on the same level. It is time we include them in education, in the revolutionized, the re revolutionizing of the education industry, specifically relating to ICT skills. We can teach people how to do things, coding for beginners, robotics, for IR, and persons with disabilities form an important role here for us. It's about inclusiveness, it's about unity, and we can fix it for our communities. Today, uh, as the Councillor Elect from Ward 34, yeah. we are supporting uh, a youth fundraising. As you can see behind me, uh, it's actually Ward 32 and Ward 34. So it's a youth supporting raise, uh, fundraiser. In, in Ward 34, um, on, on Tuesday, Wednesday, we had a, a substance abuse tournament where we sort of like invited Sanka as well and guys from the uh, Victory Outreach uh, Church and they came and shared their testimony around drugs and substance abuse um, and Sanka obviously came and had some um, education around uh, substance abuse as well. We're also looking at having Sanka on board where they will be visiting all the schools in our area in North 34 and we want to do that in North 32 as well. <laughs> Today is actually a day of all days, all right? On the first of November, yeah, it's going down. Okay, we're gonna vote for the ANC. Wow, and the ANC is going to win. Okay, we say no to corruption. Yeah, we say to a better life and a better community and a better world. Wow, Viva ANC, Viva Viva. I'm a what council candidate for Boxback Ward 32. So today we have a fundraising, yes, we have a fundraiser on the ground. They must have the, the youth, especially the youth, they must eat when they are on the ground. So we managed to, to organize the fundraising for them so that they can eat. Amanda, Viva ANC, Viva! Viva! Yeah, well, what you said to me, we are kind of raising funds. Okay. Yeah, for this branch, what they do. Yeah, we normally do it every election, every five years. We do like this. Uh, we invite the neighbors, like 34, 22, to celebrate together. All right. Yeah. I'll be specific, vote for the ANC. Wow. Because uh, I believe in the ANC. I know we have some challenges, but. Uh, if we can be honest, uh, ANC did a lot for the people of this country. Uh, I believe they still have a, a, a chance of uh, fixing some few things. And 
continue and doing Basically, as you can see, we are here, we gathered here for one reason. We want the ANC to win on the 1st of November. Wow. That's why we're here, we try to mobilize, to advise, and to raise funds. So that in the future we know that if there's anything that is fine, we can contribute, donate, so that at the end of the day, the organization can take over on the 1st of November. in terms of the safety and uh, we only hope that come the first of november we go to the polls we make sure that the anc emerge and we bring it back into governance again let us not despair people of south africa uh, let us uh, make sure that under the what called the, the, the leadership of Comrade Cyril Ramaphosa, we are led. Uh, I'm sure Comrade Cyril Ramaphosa, where he is, is happy with this kind of programs that we are behind him, we are supporting him. We make sure the Tumamina campaign becomes the success. We, we, we want him to take the second term. We need to give him the second term in the office. Oh, my God. 